hello guys welcome back to ses ltd deals if you are new here make sure you subscribe to our channel to get the best lifetime deals on ses software i'm back with another video and today i'm going to show you a comparison between hip clip and minvo so both of these deals are currently available on AppSumo as lifetime deals and both of them are great ai video editors so if you want to buy any of them make sure you check the link in the description below so in order to start the comparison the first thing that i want to show you is the plan or the features so here are all the features that you are going to get on hip clip now let's have a look at all the minvo features so here are those and now let me show you all the plans so these are some of the tiers that you can buy from AppSumo for Minvo and on these license tiers a feature that I have noticed I think that's a very significant feature so on Minvo at $59 which is the tier 1 you are getting 2 hours of video transcription every month but on hip clip let me show you the tier 1 is going to cost $49 which means it is less expensive but about the transcription you are getting even more so 4 hours of video transcription compared to Minvo's 2 hours of video transcription per month and hip clip also has another tier and Minvo also has the same so it even has one more tier which is tier 5 so now let me show you all the key differences in detail so i have already logged into both hip clip and minvo so let's go to the dashboard of hip clip first so as you can see i have uploaded a video it is about 40 seconds long and when i was uploading on hip clip this 40 second clip it took around one minute to upload or to process but on minvo i uploaded the same clip but it took much longer it took around five to seven minutes to process the video so that is something you should keep in mind so now let's open both of these videos so here's the transcription that you are going to get with hip clip and i don't think i have ever seen any other ai video editors to have better transcription than this as you can see there are proper punctuation marks so you have the commas the full stop the capitalization of letters but on minvo the transcription is a little bit different it is not as organized as hip clip and also there are some even mistranscribed words such as as you can see there is a sentence there is slid view so according to the transcription of minvo they are saying it is slid view but it is actually speed view so as you can see on hip clip they have properly come up with the transcription so that is amazing and another thing that I noticed about the transcription about the numbers hip clip is going to give you actual numbers but on minvo so as you can see the numbers is going to be in letters not in actual numbers so I think this is a very minor difference but I'm just letting you know that and now comes a very important feature that is with transcription what you can do to your video so on hip clip first of all you can edit the transcription so for example if you find any of these words are wrong for example i want to replace this workspace this word all i have to do is just double click and then this box is going to open now i can remove this word add another which means i can adjust the transcription however i want and then you can also trim your video using this transcription for example i want to trim this part so all i have to do is just select that and then click on backspace on keyboard or delete on keyboard whatever you want so as you can see now this part has been deleted from the video so this is how you can very easily trim your video on the transcription and on hip clip on the transcription you can also highlight certain parts for example i want to highlight this line so all i have to do is just click on this mark and as you can see this line is now highlighted and you can also create clips from the transcription for example i want to create a clip only from this part so all i have to do is just click on clip and then i have to provide the clip name click on create clip and i'm going to get that clip so these are basically all the features that you can use on hip clip once you get the transcription but on minvo's transcription there are more advanced features so just like hip clip on minvo you can also edit the transcription for example if you find any word to be wrong so there is already one word that is not correct this slit so if I double click on this and if I click on fix typo now I can change it so let's make it split so as you can see this way you can super easily edit the transcript edit the text or the caption on Minvo and you can also trim your video very easily all you have to do is just select your video just like Minvo and then if you press backspace on your keyboard this part is going to be deleted 
but other than these features minvo also has some more features so if you click on any word you can change the color of the caption or the transcription you can make it super size which means you can make the font bigger you can also add emoji to this particular word you can fix typo but if you double click on any word or any sentence then you can add overlay so this has to be one of the best features so as overlays you can add media so it could be image, it could be videos, it could be b-rolls, you can add text, you can add emojis, you can also cut this part and obviously you can fix the typo. And then on Minvo we have this template section so you can save your current styles and settings as preset that you can use later as templates which I think is a really good feature but you do not get that feature on hip clip. you cannot save anything as templates. And another feature that you are not going to get on hip clip is the background music. You can add background sound. So all you have to do is just upload your sound or you can also choose from their royalty free music collection. So they have upbeat sound, professional, mellow or fun. So you can also use them. And once you select a sound, you can also adjust the volume. You can add effects such as fade in, fade out. You can play it through intro, play it through outro. So this is really good they do not only have background music they also have some advanced features and then you can also translate your transcript or caption to some other language so here are all of the language options once again i have not found this feature on hip clip you cannot translate your transcript to any languages and then on Minfo, you can also add intro and outro. So they have specific features for adding intro and outro. But on hip clip, there is no option to add an intro or outro. And you can also set background image, which is once again, you cannot set on hip clip. And then something I want to talk about is this editor, the video editor interface. So the Minfo editor, it is very similar to any professional editor such as Premiere Pro or the CapCut. So as you can see, you are going to get a full timeline. You can see all of the transcription on top. You can see the background music that you added. And there are also some features such as split, clear events. You can insert any emoji, image, video, GIF, text or logo directly from here. And then they have some AI features such as this magic frame that is automatically going to frame the video to focus on speaker. So about this adjusting frame, Hip Clip also has this, but they are not going to adjust the frame automatically. You have to click on this landscape and then you have to choose your aspect ratio. So let's choose portrait. If you once again click on the video, now you can fill the canvas. And I don't think you can adjust the frame now manually. What this feature does is focuses on the middle part of the video. So you cannot really adjust it. But there's also another option which is fit canvas. So once again, you cannot adjust the frame manually on here. But on Minfo, it can automatically adjust the frame, but it also has manual framing. So if I click on this, so now I can adjust it manually. All I have to do is just move this and then this way I can adjust the frame. I can also decrease the size of this box. So there are some presets such as the center, the left, the right. So this way I can easily manually frame my video. And if I move this, as you can see, the frame is also moving. So this is amazing how easy it is to adjust the frame but unfortunately you cannot adjust in that way on hip clip and other than the auto adjusting of frame there are also some other AI features such as this magic cut which is going to remove the filler words and the silences and hip clip also have this feature so if I go to these fillers as you can see they are going to detect your filler words silences profanity and also buzzwords so you can then remove them all you have to do is just click on apply and then we have this magic emoji that intelligently adds emojis to keywords but this is a feature you do not get on hip clip and also this magic media which adds b-roll or gifs to your video so this is a really good feature but once again on hip clip you do not have automatically or manually adding b-rolls and on the timeline you have all the basic features such as the video duration the pause and play you can increase or decrease the playback rate you can zoom in or zoom out your timeline and you can also watch your video in various modes such as landscape, square and portrait. Now let's talk about the subtitle or the caption. So for editing your caption, Minvo has a lot of options. So if you just click on the caption, so as you can see on the right side, you can change the font alignment, the case or the size, the text color, background color, stroke, line. So there are a lot of settings. You can also choose from any presets 
of caption so these are some of these styles that are pre-given and you can also animate your caption from here and on hip clip you can also adjust the caption style your caption but the features are limited so if you click on these captions as you can see these are the styles that you are limited to for example i'm going to select this style and then now if i click on this transcription so now you can change the text text color the background color you can add effect you can bring it up or down and obviously you can position your subtitle wherever you want and once your video is ready you can obviously export it and during export hip clip lets you export your video in 4k but that is not possible with minvo you can import videos import 4k videos but you cannot export them as 4k but that is available on hip clip you can both import as well as export your videos in 4k on hip clip and after you have done all the editing, you can directly post your video to any social media. All you have to do is click on post and then you can post on Instagram, YouTube, TikTok, LinkedIn or Facebook. You have to make sure your accounts are connected on Minvo. But on HipClip, there's no such features that you can use in order to schedule or post your videos on any social platforms. There's another feature that I really like on Minvo. So let me go back to the dashboard. And that feature is this AI writer. So Minfo has their own AI writing assistant that you can use in order to create video titles, descriptions, podcast show notes, timestamps or whatever you want. You can even create content for social media, write tweets, write articles. So as you can see, these are some of the promotion templates on this AI writing assistant that are recommended. Then there are show notes templates. You can also find certain information using this AI and you can also refine your writing using the AI of Minvo. So overall, I think HipClip and Minvo, both of them are excellent AI editors. They both have their strength as well as weaknesses. And it is up to you to decide which one suits your needs the most. Make sure you watch all the differences. You analyze all the differences according to your use case. And this way you can find out whether HipClip or Minvo is going to be the best for you. Here are all the features that you are going to get with HipClip. And these are some of the tiers that you can buy from AppSumo. There is also last tier 4 on HipClip. And now here are all the features that you are going to get with Minvo. And these are some of the tiers. There is also tier 4 and 5. And keep in mind Minvo is going to be available on AppSumo for only next 8 days. So make sure you buy it quickly if you plan to try it. And you will get both of their links, HipClip and Minvo's in the description below. So make sure you check that. So if you are new to AppSumo, you can get 10% off your first purchase. For that, go to the link in the description. And once you enter the link, you are going to get a pop-up like this. And on this box, you have to provide your email. Then click on unlock my 10%. And then you will get a link in your email. Go to that link. And this way you can get 10%. You have to use it from AppSumo Credits gift. And this 10% discount is only for new customers. You can also join our SaaS discussion group on Facebook to get latest updates on SaaS software, exciting discounts and attractive giveaways just like this.